previous video, our vampire Eric defeats the vampire nicknamed the Sewer Dog, and he will continue to explore the sewers that Sean Hampton sent him to find answers for. This is where Jaunt's night begins. Right, we just got done beating the Sewer Dog in the previous video, and I said before, we're gonna go and explore the rest of the sewers. I look so hurt. Sean Hampton's hiding a whole bunch of skulls, I told you guys. Hello? <gasps> what was that? Hello? Skulls? I come in peace. The poor creature is bleeding to death. He cannot be far. This is the right way. Man, we got some pretty cool. What is this? No. Safe we are still. Drink now. Bless you, Richard. Oh, this isn't man. the blood of a vampire, but it will quench your thirst. What the heck is going on? This is our domain, not yours. You've been warned. Wait, I saved you from this creature. That must count for something. Thank you. Now go. Go back to the streets and houses. There is no love lost between us, vampire. But thank you. Sean Hampton sent me here. I believe he wanted me to find you. Who are you? If you must know, they call me Old Bridget, and this shelter is where we live. I'm Jonathan Reed. I'm a newborn Eccle. I'm afraid I'm not sure what's going on. I shall not bend a knee, young Eccle, but I sense your pain. Ask, and I will afford you my attention. Why was that creature after you? Fergal is the blunt instrument of the Ascalon Club. His masters would see us dead or turned into slaves if they had their way. What the hell was that thing? He wasn't an Ekon or a Skull. They are known as Volkhod, an ancient offshoot of immortals. Blood drives them, enrages them. What of this Ascalon Club? Vampire society's elite in the Empire. They make the rules and enforce their judgment upon us whom they see as lessers. So is it you that Sean Hampton sent me to find? Perhaps. The sad saint was always kind to us. He must trust you if he revealed our location. Sean is a skull. All those I've encountered have been violent, crazed creatures. How can he be any different? Maybe because he is the sad saint. Or perhaps because I am old Bridget of the Sewer Skulls. Sean killed a patient of mine. And that's just one of the murders he's being hunted for. If you refer to Harriet, she is now among us and under our protection. Harriet Jones is alive. That's it. That's the proof Sean wanted me to find. I must talk to her. No, Harriet is not alive, but you can speak to her. I must warn you, she is fragile and may not receive you warmly. I don't understand. She is filled with bile and hate. Her mind is sharp as a tack, but her body is so weak. I've never seen its like before. She is resting in a room on the far right of this hideout. Thank you. I will bear that in mind. Hmm. Okay. I never knew there was a hideout. Oh, that's not the room. You skulls try something funny. I'll make sure to end you. So 
This must be the room. Oh my. I thought you Hello, were quiet. Do you recognize me? Mmm, yes. You were from the Pembroke Hospital. The young doctor. So full of secrets. I have so many questions I need to ask you, Harriet. Wow, look if at her arm. Are. I love questions. As for the answers, you may not like them. All right, and I said I was just gonna do the main, so I'm gonna continue to stick with that. I have a question of the utmost importance to ask. Will you answer? Questions, questions, questions. The good doctor always searching for answers. Do you remember what you did after leaving the hospital? Did you kill anyone? First, a question from me. You answer first. Very well then. What do you want to know? Are you like me? Are you also dead? We are not dead, Harriet. Death no longer pertains to us. We are different. I like what I am. I truly do. I relish the pain that courses through me. I know you fled the hospital with Sean Hampton. Did you or Sean kill anyone in your flight? Anyone? Try and remember. I will not lie. I wanted blood and I wanted revenge and Sean pulled me from it brought me here instead but the shadows heard my prayers the shadows killed that bastard shadows tell me what you saw the shadows they heard me and answered something in the deep darkness quick deadly it asked me if I wanted revenge. I answered, yes. And these shadows, this presence, do you still hear it? Was it a vampire? Did Sean see it? It spoke only to me. And now it is silent, but it is born of hatred. And it will kill again. And it hates you, Doctor. Oh, it hates you. What makes you say that? It... it whispered your name, Dr. Reed. It wanted to know who you were and where you went. Questions about me? What did you say? Nothing, Doctor. I said nothing. There was nothing it didn't already know. Oh, I'm tired now. Let me rest. All right. I love you, Res. Whoa. Have you found the answers you were looking for, young Ekon? There is too much left unanswered. So many questions. Get to know us. Spend time with us. And I may be willing to answer more questions. What manner of creature is Harriet? She is different from everyone else. I really don't know. I'm not even certain she is a skull. I've no idea as to what blood made her. What is a skull, in fact, in your honest opinion? A progeny of a vampire, disavowed by her maker. Perhaps a fruitless branch of a noble tree. A word used to enslave us. I cannot say. You mentioned that vampire blood has tremendous potency. You believe it to be stronger than your own? Oh, the vampire's sweet blood. That rich, dark wine that we crave. For it made us, and it can sustain us. I thank you for your time, madam. I must go back to Sean Hampton now. Your kindness has been ample payment, Egon. To protect us, I'll close the access to our hideout, but you can use our shortcut to reach Mr. Hampton's shelter. Just follow the arrows. Thank you, old Bridget. I hope we'll meet again. Alright, so 
know, some of these skulls can actually think and not attack me violently. With all the arrows, she said. What's up, man? How you guys doing? I don't see no more arrows. Those two. So, okay, evolve quick, guys. gonna save it like that the following night right Edward should be well rested she said follow the arrows right then arrows point this way. <laughs> I'm assuming the arrows point this way, right? was locked. Can't believe I spent so many time. Like I didn't see the arrow on top of that arrow. Like, come on, man. 
Some vampire skills work better and sign energy with other skills. Try out different skill combinations before daily combos. I depend a lot on my my melee weapons and also my ultimates. Loading. Oh my. It's locked. Really? Where the heck did I just go? It's locked, all right. Welcome back, Dr. Reed. Would you like to take communion with me now? Hmm. Sean, are you eating raw flesh? It is the sacred flesh of the mortal lamb. Our Lord's bountiful transmutation for the sustenance of his believers. Thank you, Lord. I am your most humble servant. So, true to your word, you waited for my return. I told you, Dr. Reed, I was a man to be trusted. Did you have words with the poor Harriet? You make no distinction between the living and the skulls, do you? We are God's children, Dr. Reed, one and all, and he's determined to save us. Harriet, Miss Jones has been behaving in a most violent manner. She's going to need special attention. That's precisely the reason I brought her here. To meet our Bridget. She's the guide Harriet requires. Harriet is possessed by her hatred. You cannot let her roam free. She's dangerous. She has joined her own client, Doctor. Old Bridget is a saint to the younger Skulls, guiding them to salvation and peaceful existence. I believe I've learned all I need to know. I'm certain you've killed no one, but one day I believe you'll cross the line. <laughs> Logic is a false prophet. Faith is the only path to salvation. What do you mean? We have been blessed with God's eternity. We are the instruments of his divine will. We shall feed the hungry forever and ever. Amen. I will strive to emulate your merciful nature, Sean, but it's a difficult pledge to make. Give yourself over to God, Doctor. Expel your urges and kneel before the Lord in praise. These urges... You know the hunger will never be satisfied. I've come to embrace the everlasting craving. I have sworn to feed only upon the flesh of the dead. It is now my sacrament. Flesh of the dead. Take, eat. This is my body. So saith the Lord. This is a tough decision. But Sean hasn't lied. That's the one thing good about him. And and but if if you let him go, he he swore to feed on the dead corpses. 
I don't know. It, it's I'm stuck. I don't have this option. I didn't read into much info, which I should have. Embrace. I don't trust you. Oh man, this is the difficult choice. Mm. There's not enough evidence that he killed anyone, but he's been feeding off the course, so I'm gonna have to spare him. I'm sorry, guys. If you play this game and you go with this one, tell me about it. But in this video, I'm just gonna spare him. I no believe choice. you, son. In fact, I envy the peace you found and will remember it. There is love and compassion in your heart. You only need to give it wings. Thank you for your kind words, Sean. Continue your noble efforts. You are a good man in bad times. Keep to the light, my friend. Like all my flock, you have a home here. Any time you're in the neighborhood. Another corpse thrown in the streets. Someone's playing a very sick game. What is that? I know this brooch. This is my mother's. A birthday gift from father. Uh oh. Twenty nine Pretty Orchard Street. That's near Poplar's district. Why would this man carry off my mother's brooch? I must go there. I hope nothing happens. Long way, Edward. Let's do this. Well, they better hope nothing happened. Oh, snap. Boy, Come on. Okay. Is there a way up there? Shoot. Oh, these guys are pretty tough. Don't come no close. It's one of them. Move on our way. I got a mission to do. Stupid beast. I'm just passing them. They seem a little bit too hard. Twenty nine Pretty Orchard Street. This is it. What's in there for me? There's been a fight here. Oh, my. This window was shattered with violent force. Someone's been pulled through it and dragged through the street. Who could have done that? guys we're gonna end the video there next time we come back we're gonna go and find out where does this blood trail leads to it's gonna be intense i think it could be emotional i don't know i'll see you guys next time everyone stay safe all right so jonathan heads over to the address on the paper finds a blood trail leading to somewhere what will jonathan encounter next who will he meet to be continued <laughs>